There's a real science to sailing. The intended motion of a sailing vessel is the product of a great number of factors, most of which are invisible to a landsman. A sail is an aerodynamic form, just like an aircraft wing is an aerodynamic form. When you look at an aircraft wing in profile, it's curved and it's flat underneath. And as it moves through the air, the wind traveling over the top has to go farther than that underneath. So it, it moves faster and that creates lift. So as a sail billows out, that also creates lift. And in fact, it sucks the ship along. And that's why sailing ships don't always need the wind directly behind them to go. Twenty years ago, the legend of Blue Nose grabbed hold of Bruce Leeming's mind and heart and has never let go. He has been searching and researching for the resting place of that great ship, dreaming of it under full sail, out there, its shadow stroking the cresting sea. For Bruce, the Blue Nose is a pure spirit on open water. Like the dolphins, Blue Nose is a symbol of hope. Its story is an allegory for salvation. And it looks as though, right now, one symbol of hope is guiding Bruce to another. Based on the wreck report and on information from a letter from Wilson Beringer, the captain of the Blue Nose when she went down, to Angus Walters, the team has identified the most likely location for finding wreckage from the famous schooner. The dive site lies along this lengthy curved reef. Mad reefs crisscrossing currents and strong surge have wrecked many a ship with a vengeance. <laughs> 